a dead man's trigger is basically when you set up a condition where if something happens to you, there is such a cache of information that nobody has seen yet that would hit the media and hit the internet that you're better off alive. I was advised in uh, early 1990s to create this dead man trigger where if something were to happen to me or my team, my senior team, there would be information uh, and documents and other materials that would be released from multiple sites and for people who are plugged in to media and media companies and what have you uh, and it would be very hard to stop it. Now the reason for that is not that I'm trying to be so aggressive, is that you have to have a countermeasure to the threats. Whatever it is that people have seen that we put out so far, um, there's so much more. There's much more than the scope of a two hour film can contain or a hundred hours would contain. Uh, and some of it is, are, is information, documents, names, places, people. But it became very clear to me that, you know, you kind of had a tiger by the tail here and that this was serious. And it was serious enough that we put this dead man trigger in place uh, right away.